Good morning, guys. <laughs> what was that? All right, guys, happy Vlogmas day 20 because I did in fact skip day 18 and 19 because I was busy went to work got off work went to I went out of town to celebrate my friend's graduation his family rented out a bar so we spent like so long there we went to all these bars went out a bunch so um, I didn't make it home till like 4 30 in the morning to top it all off I didn't wake up until like 1 40 in the afternoon so there was no video yesterday I couldn't do it it wasn't humanly possible you guys wouldn't have liked the video anyways because it would have sucked so there's my apology for that I'm sorry today's a new day I have some errands to run I want to share with you guys so we're gonna start with a little bit of makeup I already washed my face brushed my teeth ate breakfast drank some coffee now I'm going to get ready and then I want to show you guys a little little haul I went to Target last night with my mom at like 8 o'clock at night and I went to Marshall's so I want to show you guys what I got and then I'm gonna show you guys what I got sent in the mail which I'm so so excited about yeah once I get ready I will share that stuff with you guys I'm not trying to do anything crazy today with my makeup this is literally still a stamp from the bar I can't can't get it off so you see this it's ignoring love that if y'all are wondering where hazel is she's downstairs with my parent in the morning when i'm like just sitting in my room i usually put her downstairs with them because she can play and like not be stuck in my room you are literally causing chaos down there as always so guys today what i'm running errands for for this meeting that i'm going to on tuesday there's a dress code business professional which i don't own so i need to go buy some business professional clothing You want to know my outfit details this little necklace is from Marshall's of course it was ten dollars this flannel is from Marshall's the tag's still on it actually I just put it on I'm back I had to cut the tag off the shirt before I forgot because I'm wearing it today I wanted to come here and show you guys a quick little Marshall and Target haul and then show you what I got in the mail that I'm very excited about so like I said I got this flannel from Marshall's it's super cute I got this shirt to my crop long sleeve with stars and it was ten dollars so love her next slightly turtleneck cheetah long sleeve shirt which i thought would be so cute to wear under like graphic tees and stuff i wasn't gonna buy anything that was not business professional outfit because that's why i went there but then when i saw this shirt it just like started buying more so couldn't help it this shirt i thought was so cute it doesn't really look that great on camera but it's like this white and black cheetah print and it like wraps in the front i think it's adorable lastly from marshall's i got this phone case you guys know i'm obsessed with phone cases um, this one's a spec one. I don't know if you can really see, but it's glittery. I thought it was cute for the holidays. I also went to Target. I got these sweatpants because I thought them they were so cute and they have this little mouth on them, which I love. So I had to get them. They're just black sweatpants. They were $20. Uh, and then I got this stuff, which is the arc after brushing whitening treatment and this i saw on tiktok and rightfully so why it has been sold out for so long because it's amazing now what i got in the mail this what i got in the mail from fabfitfun i'm so excited fabfitfun reached out to me and offered to send me their box to be a campus rep for them so here i am and i want to show you guys what i got now let me grab one more item though hold on i'm not gonna lie to you guys i already opened the box i've already tried stuff out but like I couldn't help it. I want to share with you guys what I got. So you open the box. It's messy because I already opened everything. First thing that I was so excited when I opened this box was I got an impression vanities mirror. Like what I had to go grab. This bad boy. I've wanted one of these for so long and I'm so excited. You literally just press this and it lights up like and this baby is HD let me tell you because I almost didn't want to look in the mirror because of how crazy my skin looks. But this is amazing and I love it. Such a great thing. If you're in college be perfect for a dorm room or a small apartment where you have to share a bathroom with someone. Then I left this in my car. The picture of it like right here is a velvet maroon headband and it's just so cute i love it and for me personally maroon is my school colors so it works great for me i actually wore it friday night to my friend's graduation party because we're the same school a m so the colors are maroon so i wore that and it was so cute another thing i was so excited to see is from dp hue 
and it's the apple cider vinegar dry shampoo i've been wanting to try a powder dry shampoo like this because i don't wash i only wash my hair like once or twice a week dry shampoo is very important to me i love dry shampoo it's also great for if you're running late to class which i've been there before and you don't have time to wash your hair dry shampoo it is another great thing in here is this little wallet and this is so adorable the brand is below the belt let me tell you why you would need one of these because first off it has a little zipper on the back which is nice so that if there's something you have that's important you can put it in here and it will not fall out it's basically a little wallet card holder so there's like this pouch there's three ones right here and you can put your id credit card cash in here um this pouch could probably hold your keys to your car and then you can put this in a tiny little clutch to go out to the bars or something um or if you're going to a party or it can fit in your pocket which is what i love to do you don't have to worry about a purse you don't have to carry it around it's just in this thin little convenient wallet that fits in your pocket and you're good to go another thing i was super excited to see is this tula skincare which I love Tula. I use their face wash every single day. And this is the Glow and Get It Cooling and Brightening Eye Balm, which I'm not going to lie, I've been wanting to try this for so long, so I'm happy to have this in here. Thank you so much, Fun. Another product I got is this Aesthetica Liquid Eyeliner, which I have tried their products before, but not their makeup. So I'm super excited. This is just a black liquid liner, um, perfect for a winged liner for going out you know second to last product i have to show you guys is this daily concepts daily face dry brush this is what it looks like so i'm really excited to incorporate this into my morning routine the last thing which i was excited about all these products but this one i'm really excited for it is a robe from summer and rose oh it's so soft i was just looking at my old robes thinking about how i need a new one this oh my gosh it has a hood too this is so comfy oh my god this is so soft i love that yes fat fit fun yes so i want to quickly talk about fat fit fun if you don't know about them now that i've showed you the amazing products that you get in your box so fat fit fun is a seasonal subscription box you will get four boxes a year you don't have to get one every season you can pause your subscription when you want you'll be gifted fashion beauty lifestyle fitness products and you take a customizable quiz you can even pick some of the products in your box so you make sure you get everything you love and fat fit fun's mission is to deliver happiness to everyone everywhere so they want to guarantee that you always love every product in your box so as a college student I've been there where you don't want to spend the money um, and I totally get that maybe you can ask for this box for Christmas ask for a subscription for Christmas that would be so nice and I definitely would do that with my code that I'll leave in the description box below and I also put it right here on the screen you can get $10 off your first box making it $39.99 so every box is usually valued at over $200 but with my code you can get one box for $39.99 how amazing how amazing right like i said on the screen i'll have my code right here it's just kaylee also all the details will be the very first thing in my description box below so go check it out that's about all i have to say right now so i'm gonna grab my stuff my bag go get in my car and we're gonna go run some errands and i wish that i could love you like the man that loves the sky I'm at Marshall's. I've made it. My thought process for today is I'm going to go to Marshall's. If I don't find anything good in Marshall's, then I will go JCPenney's. So I'm going to go into Marshall's. I'll probably eat some lunch and get Starbucks because it sounds so good. Every time I leave the house, I have to get Starbucks. That's what we're doing. So let's go. Ooh, guys. Bag secured. Chipotle. Okay, I haven't had Chipotle in a hot minute okay a hot minute Dalton's gonna be jealous when he's watching this sorry babe you know you guys know I like been eating low carb keto I, I can't really say keto anymore because I haven't been eating 100% keto so I'm not keto I just try to be low carb I'm tired of eating chick-fil-a every single time and getting like a bunless sandwich i got chipotle this is what it looks like let me show you guys i got steak for the first time i've never gotten steak there this is my bowl why is chipotle so expensive does someone want to explain that to me i got a bowl with no rice no beans steak fajita veggies white queso guac mild pico cheese and lettuce 
That's pretty good. Pretty good. I went to Marshall's. I didn't get anything. There was nothing there. There was a ton of people. I didn't feel like shopping anymore. So I just decided to get food right now. And then we'll go to Starbucks later because, duh. Yeah, guys. I'm going to stay here, eat this food, then get back on the road, go to JCPenney's, and I'll talk to you guys then. PSA, you will not see me anywhere else going out in public the rest of the holiday season until Christmas is over. This is crazy. Everywhere I've gone has been in extremely packed. Outfit secured, but I couldn't find any shoes, so I went to Target, um, and I just need to get home to edit this vlog so that I can have a vlog up for you guys today because, you know, I didn't have one the past two days and I feel terrible. So this vlog is going up today. But let me tell you what happened to me when I left JCPenney's. So I get done shopping at JCPenney's, I check out whatever. I'll show you guys when I get home what all I got from JCPenney's. But I check out and I walk outside the door and my car is nowhere to be found. Could not find it, I didn't see it anywhere. I was like, where is my car? I start freaking out. My car is nowhere in this parking lot and I almost start crying. So I call my dad. I'm like, the car is gone. And this car is like not a super nice car. It's a Jeep Renegade. I mean, look it up. My dad's literally just like, why would someone steal that car? It doesn't make sense. And I'm like, I know. Then this little old man rolls down his window and he's like, press the button on your key and it'll sound the alarm off. You can find your car. And I was like, I did that and it's not working. Then he goes, maybe you parked on the other side of the store. And I'm like, what? I'm like, oh my God, okay, there's a whole other side. And he's like, be careful. And I'm like, okay, thank you. On the phone with my dad, almost in tears because I thought someone stole my car. And then I find it in the other parking lot. So I'm just stupid and yeah. guys i'm back show you guys what i just got at the store so i can get this video up tonight gotta love vlogmas am i right <laughs> oh actually one more i forgot but i went to sephora inside the jc pennies before i went shopping and i bought good thing i did because they gave me a 35 percent off coupon for jc pennies so that's nice but i bought the rare beauty liquid touch brightening concealer and I got the shade 170W. It says moisturizing buildable concealer that melts seamlessly into your skin. Undetectable cake-free coverage. This is what it looks like. Can't obviously can't test it, but 170 looks like a good shade. Anyways, I was looking for a new concealer, so I thought I'd try this. Casey Helms says she likes it, so I of course had to try it. The main reason I went shopping today was to find an outfit for my interview on Tuesday. The dress code for the interview is business professional, which I don't own anything business professional so I went to JCPenney's which is a great place to go everything was on sale then on top of that I got 35% off so I bought basically a suit and two shirts for $76 so really really great deal first thing I'll show you is these dress pants I wanted to get a nice pair of slacks these are the ones I got um, I mean they don't really look anything special but they are the curvy straight leg I love these these bit great so they were nice and then to go with that I got a blazer I really wanted to wear a blazer when I found I ended up really liking all the other ones had shoulder pads which okay I have like broad shoulders as it is so it gave me just a really manly look on me and I wanted a more feminine one so I found this one it didn't have shoulder pads but it's hard to see because it's black I ended up really liking that I bought this like satin shirt that I thought would go really cute under the blazer. So let me show you. This is what it looks like. It's like this cute little satin shirt with like ruffles and then it has like a bow in the front and it's short sleeve. It'd be nice and comfortable under the blazer. I just thought it was super pretty in like this cream color. I was checking out. I saw this shirt which potentially I might still wear. I saw this shirt and thought it was really really pretty. It's this red blouse with like a bow on the front and then the sleeves are this like pleated sleeves. It's just really pretty. So I bought a pair of shoes at Target, which I hope are okay. I'm gonna ask my mom what she thinks. They were only $14, flats. I feel like having a nice pair of like black flats to wear to professional things is nice. So I got these, they're like um, suede and they're just pointy toed flats. I thought they looked really nice and they'll look nice, you know, with the suit. 
But yeah, guys, that is all I got today. That's the end of my video today. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you're new here, go ahead and click the subscribe button down below. Join my channel. We have five more days left of Vlogmas, guys. I think that's all I have to say for today's video. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.